Howdy folks, welcome to the CompTIA Network Plus course. If you're wondering why this video is so short, well, that's because this video is actually just the course introduction video. Its purpose is basically to explain a little bit about what the course is all about. The rest of the videos in this playlist, which will follow this one, now those will be the actual lessons where I teach you guys the course content. Now regarding the course folks, this course is based on the N10-009 version to CompTIA Network Plus course, which is currently the latest version of the course at the time that this video was made. The full course will be covered on the channel, and yes, it will be enough to be able to pass the official exam that's associated with this course in case that's your goal. Now, a little bit about me as the trainer, I have a vast amount of experience of CompTIA Network Plus as well as just networking in general. I've been teaching Network Plus along with many other courses for about 15 years now, folks, and I also have a lot of experience in the industry as an engineer in the field. Now, as for the course overview and objectives, the full official Network Plus course consists of about roughly 14 modules, folks. That's the new version. This video course is based on that new version, which is the 10.009 version I spoke of. It was released in June 2024, and normally every time CompTIA releases a version of a course, it lasts about roughly three to three and a half years before the release, a newer version. So you can do the math as to when it will be retired. This video course, guys, will cover all 14 of the modules in the official Network Plus course. Um, however, unlike my A-plus course on my channel where I cover a full module in just one video, which is normally like an hour or two hours long, um, the N-plus stuff is a little bit too advanced, so I might be overwhelming some of the guys that's new to, to N-plus. So instead, I'm going to be doing the videos in bite-sized videos. So I'm going to chop the, the lessons in each of these modules into smaller bite-sized videos, which are easier to consume and easier to digest. Um, hopefully the content will stick a little bit easier then, you know, if it's more bite-sized videos. And then just to help you guys find what you're looking for in these videos, in each video's description, there's going to be timestamps, which I'm going to add there to make your life a little bit easier. So if you're looking for a specific topic in that video, you'll be able to go and find it a lot quicker. This course, guys, like I said earlier, it will cover enough to pass the N plus international certification exam. But you need to be aware that that exam is not just questions. It also consists of performance based questions. We call those PBQs for short, which is basically a simulation in a nutshell. Who is this course intended for? Well, guys, it's probably intended for you, especially if your intention is to go and write the exam. So first of all, the course can be used by folks preparing for the N10-009 certification exam. So if that's your purpose, you know, to go and write the exam and hopefully pass it, well, yes, this course will be enough to be able to do that. The course can also be used by other people. So if you are people that wants to just brush up on networking things in general, you know, maybe there's something specific in networking that you would like to go and look up, well, it's going to serve that purpose, especially if you go look at the small bite-sized videos. The course can also be used to troubleshoot a network-related problem you may or may not be facing at the office or at home. So if there's a certain problem you're facing, chances are you might actually find a solution in one of these videos. And then lastly, folks, the course can be used just to improve your general knowledge of networking in general. You know, sometimes we just want to learn a little bit more. There's no reason why you can't go and do that. Some people, honest to goodness, they just want to learn something more. And um, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Now, a little bit about the exam itself, guys. So the exam code for this course is going to be the exact same. So the exam code, there it is at the top in the title. It's exactly the same as the course code. If you're wondering how much time you will have in this exam, they normally give you approximately 90 minutes. So that's an hour and a half you will have. You will get no more than 90 questions. So it might be less than 90 questions, but you will not get more than 90 questions. If you want to pass the exam, you need to score at least 720 out of 900. So that's not 72% because it's out of a scale of 900. So you can go and work it out. It's actually a little bit more than 72% you need to go and score. As for the type of questions you might encounter in the exam, I did mention that earlier in the video, you're going to be getting mostly multiple choice questions, but you're also going to get a lot of performance-based questions. The average person that writes the N plus exam normally gets about two or three PBQ questions in the exam, but it could be less or it could be more. It's just on average, the average person will get roughly about two or three PBQs, which means you're going to have to practically do something in the exam to get your mark. And just a quick recap as for when this course was released, it was released on 20 June 2024, and it's most likely going to be retired around roughly October 2027. 
That's just me doing a rough estimate, normally based on past experience. Almost every CompTIA course, not just N+, normally lasts about three to three and a half years where before CompTIA will go and retire and release a new version. And when they release a newer version, you'll normally find that you can actually go into the previous old version as well as the new one, um, kind of parallel for like three to six months. So at the moment, we find ourselves in that period as I'm making this video. We're kind of in that transitioning phase where you can do the 008 or the 009 version of the course. It's your choice which one you want to do. It's your choice which exam you want to go and write. Um, but that period is normally not very long. So very, very soon, the 008 is going to be discontinued. So the 008 version of the exam is going to be discontinued or retired in December 2024. At least that's the date that CompTIA has given us for now. But, you know, obviously that they reserve the right to change this whenever they want. All right, folks, it's been a pleasure having you in this short little video. Um, I hope to see you guys in lesson one. So please stay tuned for lesson one. Keep an eye out for it. If you don't want to miss it, make sure you subscribe. Otherwise, you might miss it. And if you haven't done it already, give this video a like so that more people can see it. And if more people can see it, then obviously I'll be able to help more people out there with content, you know, people that cannot afford free study material. You know, at the end of the day, study material is very expensive, as, you, as I'm sure you guys already know. And lastly, guys, before we conclude this video, if you're not aware, I do have a Discord server. It is called Free IT Training. You're more than welcome to join it. It's going to be the very last link in this video's description. So go check it out. Free server, I'm in that server. There's other trainers in that server. Um, other people studying this course on that server. And even people that's already written this exam, they're also in that server and they're there to help other people. So if you would like to help other people or if you'd like to ask questions, you're more than welcome to do it in that server. There's lots of other courses also covered in that server. All right, folks, I will see you in lesson one of the new Network Plus course.